wait a minute, like, wait, wait. Are Nigerian Nivea lotions fake? Are the foreign Nivea lotions the original ones? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in today. If you're just in this space for the first time, hi, my name is Chema Akadizi. And here on this channel, we do basically skincare tips, products reviews, and the iOS. When I mean products reviews, we will be products both for skin and health. I also share healthcare tips and also review some healthcare, very, very good healthcare products that are going to be so, so good for our health because at the end of the day, health is where it's okay. Without further ado, let's get straight into this video for today. These questions are mostly frequent asked questions. I get this question a lot from my subscribers. A lot of you will be like, please, which one is the foreign one? How can I get the foreign one? Someone actually asked me, and yes, it's because of this, uh, one of our many subscribers, she asked me and she was like, please, Nigerian Nivea lotion, the fake one, or how can she get the original one? This is for this reason I'm making this video today. I want to actually clarify some things and make you all understand some things. Like if you've been following me for a while now, you know that I've done about four to five videos here on my channel for Nivea. So please do not go anywhere because some things need to be clear. Okay? So stay tuned to the words end of the video. Do not click away. Stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. First thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to brief you on the history of Nivea. Like before we go into other things, we just want to have like a background knowledge of Nivea products. Nivea is one of the biggest, largest skincare brand, which is in over 150 countries as we speak because it's it's an OG. It is a German special care brand that specializes in skin and what body care. It is owned by Hamburg based company BS Dorf Global AG. This company, this brand, was actually founded in 28th March 1882. Like, <laughs> like it's about 100 years ago. So it was found in 28th March 1882 by Paul Carr BS Dorf, but it was launched in 1911. This cream is an expert when it comes to moisturizing, hydrating, and caring for the skin. Like, that's just their basis. Like, that's what they're actually known for. Moisturizing, hydrating, and caring for the skin. The ingredients that are usually to actually make their lotions are ingredients that help to do what? Moisturize, hydrate. The emulent in it helps to do what? Soften, moisturize, and decrease itching and a flaky skin. So now the second question here is, which company produces Nivea products? Like I said earlier in the history, it is a German brand that specializes in what? Skin and body care. It is owned by Hamburg-based company, that's Biersdorf AG. The third question here is, when did the Nivea brand come into Nigeria. Nivea brand came into Nigeria in 2017. In, though the Nivea brand itself had made itself visible and has existed in the Nigerian market for over what 50 years. It was now until 2017 the company BS officially announced its arrival in Nigeria. Like this um Nivea, it's like I said, is a Hamburg-based company. BS of Global Age, that means it is a multinational company. They have their company in so many countries. It was in 2017 that they announced their arrival here in Nigeria. Now the next question here is, which company produces Nivea products in Nigeria? It is the BS of Nivea Consumer Products, Nigeria Limited Company. They are the ones that are doing what? Producing the Nivea dot here in Nigeria. Nivea has actually had their factory here in Nigeria since 1947, but some factory actually closed down because of um, 
low cost of production. But nevertheless, the company is still here. Like if you want to get the original Nivea products, you just go straight to the company and get up with one of their distributors and you'll be able to get their the original Nivea product. Are the Nigerian Nivea products the fake one? No, they are not. The answer is what? No. They are not the fake products. The problem is where you actually get your Nivea products from. The Nivea products for Nigerians is just particularly made for us, our kind of skin, and because of our kind of weather, they are not the fake ones. So now the problem now is where you are actually getting your products from. So now, how will you be able to know the original Nivea from the fake one? So when you want to get a Nivea product, one thing you should take note of is the bad font, the spelling. Yes, I've actually come in contact with a Nivea product that, though it was, I didn't, it was not in, it was not really a cosmetic store, but it's just someone who sells more food provisions and she's also selling creams. So when I checked the font, though I'm sure she wasn't really aware, but it depends on where she actually got a Nivea product from. She didn't get it directly from the company. The spelling of it was natural. It's sort of natural fairness. It was natural fairiness. So that is a red flag. So when you want to get, when you want to get an Nivea product, you want to make sure that you take note of the font. Check the font and be sure that the spelling is what correct. The font is correct. Nivea is not written in small letter. The N. Uh, is never written in small letters instead it's written in capital letters so in case you see any Nivea product that the end is in a small letter please that is a red flag it is not the original one so the second thing you want to take note of is the packaging the packaging of the product is always in a flat um top like as a flat um top and it's so sealed, it's so strong, and their packaging is so top notch because they use quality containers and they have good quality package. So if you're getting a Nivea product that the packaging is somehow it's not strong, it's even loose, you can easily flip it open anyhow, or it's there's just something not right about it, then you should come to them that okay, this is not the original one, that is a counterfeit. Another thing you want to check in for is the consistency of the product. The consistency of the product should be what? Smooth this and firm. It should be what? Smooth and firm. See it? Something like this. You should not have this uh, wonky feeling or residues in it. No matter how thick it may actually look. Whenever you apply it to your skin, it is has a very, very smooth consistency and it absorbs into the skin. If it is too watery or it has chunks inside of it, like this one doesn't have chunk, it has some kind of chunk inside of it, then you know that, that is the fake one or it has expired. Hmm? It's either it is the fake one or the Nivea product has expired next thing you want to pay attention to is the fragrance the smell it has a very very mild and a very overwhelming scent it does not really have a strong or very 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 strong scent any of the products you are using that has a very very strong fragrance i'm sorry that is likely to be the counterfeit that's likely to be the fake one Nivea do not use strong ingredients or very very harsh ingredients to do what to make their products okay another thing you should take note of is Nivea products do not bleach the skin they do not bleach so if you are you got a Nivea product that is actually bleaching you or is making you like go out of your shade I'm sorry you bought the counterfeit because Nivea products would what they basically do like I said from the start is just moisturizing and hydrating Though they will actually brighten your skin, like brighten up your skin, but when it comes to bleaching you, like taking you three shades, four shades lighter, no. I've been saying it on my channel for a very long time and I'll keep saying it. They do no such thing. They will not whiten you. They will not take you three shades lighter. They do not do that. So the ones that may actually brighten you up are those ones that are so, so infused with vitamin C. They are the ones that would 
brightening up your skin. The last one is um the application. You want to get the application like if you notice when I actually apply, look at see my hand. My hand is still looking it's looking soft and moisturizing. Can you see? So you want to make sure that you take note of the application. Uh, when you apply the Nivea lotion on your skin, you want to make sure that you take note of the application that it easily absorbs into your skin. In Nivea, it does not easily absorb into your skin. If it takes a lot of time to absorb or it now gives you this oily feeling, whenever you apply it on your skin, it's giving you this oily feeling like your skin is satin, it's showing a lot of oils and all and you know you do not put any body oil on it then I'm sorry, you've gotten the fake Nivea products that will give you an oily feeling on your skin or actually prevent your skin from breathing feeling and causing your skin to do what? break out okay, once people come to me and say I was using this Nivea product and it's giving me rashes on my face giving me eczema and I'm surprised because any body lotions that actually moisturize your skin and hydrate your skin only if they use an oil that your skin is sensitive to or it has a lot of oil infused in it or you just got the fake one that is when eczema breakout is likely to happen like look at I've applied it to my skin you can't see my skin is not shining it's not looking oily or you can't see any oily feeling in the residue it's just soft smooth and it's easily absorbed into my skin so when you take note of all those things that i just mentioned now you'll be able to do what identify the fake and original one things if there are also other things that you have also taken note of and i did not mention here on my channel please put down in the comment section to also help some people to also help people too and also enlighten us not just us me and you can also enlighten other people here there in the comment section okay so nigeria nivea products are not the fake ones they are not the fake every country has the nivea that is actually made for their country okay like if you go to the us you are likely to be using the nivea products for their kind of skin over there now, the level of melanin we have on our skin is different from their own kind of melanin okay so whenever you want to get an Nivea lotion so check for their email or if you don't have their email you can totally google out their email and send them pictures front back underneath on top of it to actually um send it to them so that they can actually tell you whether the one you actually got is the fake or the original one okay so guys that will be all for today's video i don't want this video to be very very long i just want to just hit the nail at the head and clarify it and make you know that the nigerian Nivea product is not the fake one it's where you're actually getting it from and i'm actually and to also enlighten you about Nivea and also tell you how to actually identify the fake from the original Nivea product so thank you so much for joining me today thank you so much my 3000 and more subscribers thank you guys so much for supporting me for sticking to me you guys are the best here on youtube thank you so so much and finally i hope you found this video really really helpful if you have questions please put it down in the comment section if you also have suggestions to make please put it down in the comment section and if you also want to add to what i've said about Nivea nigeria please put it down in the comment section and until then i'm going to see you guys in my next video bye guys